Hello and welcome to yet another episode of Hanging Out with Mimi Kitchen Space. In today's recipe, let's make some breakfast from scratch. I'm planning to have some potatoes, an egg, some fruits and black coffee. So stick around and let me show you how to go about it. And without further ado, let's get started. So for the list of ingredients, I'm going to list them in the description bar. I'm also going to indicate them on the screen as we go along. So this is water that I'm just boiling and I want to boil my potatoes till they become soft. So I'm going to start off by adding some salt so that once they boil, the salt can penetrate into the potatoes. I'm going to cover this and let it come to a boil, then I'll be back. I'm going to add my potatoes and I've simply diced my potatoes and these are just two medium small potatoes. So I'll cover this and I'll be back once they are ready. So I'll check if my potatoes are done and you simply check by inserting a fork and when it goes through the potato easily you know that it is done. So mine are done and I'm going to strain the water. And for this particular recipe, you do not need to run it on cold water. So once my pan is hot, I'm going to go in with about two drops of oil. And I'll go in with some butter. I normally like adding oil so that my butter does not burn. Because ukiongeza uh, butter peke yake, it will tend to burn faster than uki mix butter na mafuta. I'll wait for my butter to become extremely hot, but make sure not to burn your butter. Then I'll go in with my spices, and for today I'm using some dried rosemary. Add some paprika. So in this recipe, you can feel free to add whichever spices you like. I'm also going to go in with some turmeric and finally I'm going to add some salt but remember do not add a lot of salt because our potatoes have boiled with some salt and I'm going to toast this and let them cook so at this point you're simply like just bringing together the spices and yeah So I'm going to make sure that I turn each and every one of them so that the spaces can stick to the potatoes. So my potatoes are done and you can see that the spaces in Ishkilia are potatoes and it's a little bit crusty on each side so I'm going to set them aside I like my egg well done and I'm just having one egg so I'm going to use this but you can also use a non-stick pan but this will take a little bit longer again once my pan is hot I'm going to add in some oil I'll add a pinch of salt. You can also add black pepper, but I ran out of black pepper. And I'll wait for my egg to form a brown crust because that's how I like it. Also, I'm heating my water that I'm going to use for my black coffee. So finally, my egg is well done and it's not time to plate it.
So now let's have a test test and I'm going to test each and everything. Oh, look at this. Mm. It tastes amazing. You can test the rosemary and you can also test the turmeric. I'd vote for this recipe. Then let's come to the egg. And as I mentioned, I like my egg well done. The egg is also delicious. Mm. And this combination, if only I had some tomato sauce, it will be a very great combination. So for the fruits, I've decided to have some tangerine. It is so good and some tree tomato. AKA Tonyondores. This is ripe and also tastes amazing. Mm. So, as you think, it was that easy making a healthy and balanced breakfast. As you can see, I have my protein, I have my fruits, and also I have my carbohydrates and such. So, that's it for today's episode. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't. And I'll definitely see you in my next one. Bye. Bye.